Hey guys, today I want to show you something interesting about a chocolate milk item that some of you may not know. You all know how the item works in general. You charge your tears to deal more damage or you tap the fire button really fast to shoot many weaker tears rapidly. Back in Afterbirth Plus the damage of each shot was ranging from 10% at no charge up to 400% of your damage set at full charge and the maximum fire rate was fixed at 15. But what most people don't know is that the item actually got a very important change in Repentance regarding how it interacts with your tier stat. Back in Afterbirth Plus, increasing your tier stat only reduced the time you needed to charge the shots of the item, but now, in the current version of the game, it also affects your damage. A higher tier stat will now also increase the minimum damage of your tiers. Notice how the damage of the full fire rate tiers went up from 1 each to 1.3 each. The damage of the full charge tiers will always stay at 400% of your damage stat, but each increase in your tier stat will further boost the lower end of your uncharged shots. You will already deal more than 50% of your damage stat per non-charged shot when you reach a tier soft cap of 5, which is 5 times the damage they would have dealt in Afterbirth Plus. But you can of course go even higher with items that can push you above the soft cap. Mom's Perfume, for example, grants a flat plus 0.5 on fire rate, which further increases the damage. At a tier rate of 10, the charge time of the full charged shots will already be nearly instant, but more importantly, the non-charged shots deal more than 100% of your damage. By the way, if you are wondering how I am able to shoot this fast, watch the video that I linked in the top right, where I show a chocolate milk bug revolving around the optional mouse control. But I am not done with the showcase yet. There is one more weird mechanic that triggers at a tier rate of 30. Right now I am at 29.5 tiers. The full charge is ready instantly but still deals 14 damage while the non-charged rapid fire deals insane 11 damage per tier. But something rather strange happens when you somehow manage to reach 30 tiers. The ability to charge shots will be removed and you always shoot at the max fire rate. This wouldn't be bad on its own, but the problem is that the damage per tier suddenly goes way down. Each tier only hits for roughly 50% of the damage they did at 29.5 tiers. Increasing the tier set further will once again boost the damage of the shots, but you will notice that there is a limit to this that is hit way before the tiers cap of 120. Precisely, the damage per shot can't go over 400% of your damage stat, which is the regular damage of the full charged chocolate milk shots. This value is reached at 75 tiers. And of course, normal damage up items will still increase the damage of chocolate milk as usual, which makes the new tier stat mechanic even better since it acts like a multiplier. Now that you know about this, make sure to grab as many tiers up items as you can in your chocolate milk runs. Increasing the minimum damage multiplier will greatly boost your overall DPS. Down from